Yeah, hello again, everybody, and welcome back to the Fujits Blitz with me, Fujit. Hello. So I recently did a video on why I like the Badger, and I thought might as well do another video on why I like the AMX 50B. Now, look, unless you've been living under a rock, lots of people like the 50B. I mean, some YouTubers swear by it. Oh, it's like the biggest damage monster machine out there, and. To an extent, it can be, but only in the right hands. Plus, you need an enemy that likes to stick itself in front of your gun. The thing about the AMX 50B is it has a spectacular gun. It really, really does. It has an amazing amount of damage contained in that little turret and in that magazine. However, it doesn't have the best armor in the world, let's be honest with you. Now, again, I could sit here and show you all the tank compare and all the stats and everything, but again, it's not going to do anything for you. I mean, you're not going to be rolling out in this thing thinking, oh my god, I've got to remember the dispersion was zero point blah 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 blah. It's not going to work. What you need to know is the following. This gun is fantastic. Okay, It has got a relatively long magazine reload. However, as long as you can stick it in a place whereby you've got some cover to get behind whilst you're reloading, it ain't going to cause you too many problems. Its penetration is pretty good. I mean, look at this 60 TP here. There goes one, and let's load another one. There goes number two, and let's load a third one. And there we go. All three into the front of a 60 TP. Wow, that's a lie. Two of them went into the front of the 60 TP, one of them went into the side of the turret. That's what you can do with the 50B. Now all I've got to do is get back into cover and wait for the reload. Okay, I bugger it up in a minute, I must admit. My shots are a little bit wayward. However, I'm, uh, I mean, I'm giving them a bit of a hard time. So that one just tracks him. And this one is gonna bounce. There we go, that's a bounce. And the third one is not gonna be charmed because I'm gonna aim for the IS-7 and knock it into him instead. But, you know, we've done, in next to no time, almost 3,000 damage. We've got them on the ropes. I mean, they've, got, they've lost three, we've lost two. I'm now going to completely ignore the 60 TP in the IS-7. I want to go down here and get these shots and farm a bit of damage from this E-100, which is exactly what I'm going to do. There goes number one, and two's a charm. Yes, it is. And three, just for the hell of it, and there you go. So, we did 4K, and that's what you can do in this thing. I mean, this tank is realistically an easy 4k damage machine but 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 it isn't the easiest tank to get on with because of that armor and you've got to find those spaces and as you saw here i didn't do any moving realistically i just stayed where i was and farmed and that is what you can do in the 50b anyway i've been fujit by all means comment in everything below and until the next time stay safe out there have fun on the battlefield and happy tanking because that is what it's all about having fun and being Happy.